I could swear I heard something. Hmm. Probably nothing. All right, all right. Ooh, Christmas cookies for KH. Mmm, very nice. Karate coffee. I like. Mmm, 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 mmm. Strike first, strike hard, show mercy, not. All right, hmm, what do we have here? Hello, hmm. He was a man of peace, living a quiet life in North Dakota. He was a cop and good at his job, but he committed the ultimate sin. Sometimes, to win war, you must become war. You broke my record. Now I break you like I break your friend. <laughs> uh, the rat, so it has a name. It had a name. Very good. But now you die. Ping, 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 ping. Hello, um, I'm just working on a script for a future movie project. Just give me a second, I'll get back to you. Okay, okay. Mm, more coffee for Cage. Ah, much better. Hey guys, and welcome back to the final episode of the Shaka Kapow Christmas comic book calendar 2021. Jiggity jiggity jiggity. Bing bing bing. Ding ding ding. Kapow. Yeah. So this is also the final episode for this year, and I know what you're thinking. You're like, KH, my dude. Christmas is over. Get over it already. And I'm here to tell you, Christmas is over. When I say it's over, Buster. It's not over yet. You haven't seen anything. Get ready. So, you know, like the Christmas elves went back to their own dimension after Santa defeated them again. And Santa's gone back to like his cabin in the woods. So all is good. And yeah. Um, so I know I was gonna do 24 episodes, but we just didn't have the time. This year was really busy. But I'm thinking 12 is a good number. Okay, so I have something special for today's episode. And um, the other day I went to the movies and I watched Matrix Resurrections. And I know the movie's gotten a lot of hate, but to be honest, I thought it was quite okay. It was entertaining and I actually liked it better than Matrix 3. But it doesn't matter. Um, it was really cool to see Keanu Reeves and Carrie Ann Moss in their roles as Neo and Trinity. And I really like Keanu Reeves. Uh, whatever he's in, it's always cool. The movie might not be the best movie, but he's always good in it. And this brings me to today's episode. So for today, we are taking a look at John Wick, no, uh, Berserker by Keanu Reeves and Matt Kint. So, Berserker or Berserker, 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 Berserker um, is a comic book written by Keanu Reeves and Matt Kint. It's illustrated by Ron Garney. And we have Clem Robbins doing the letters. And yeah. 
This is a comic book by Boom Studios. And it's really cool. So, I'm a huge Keanu Reeves fan, as I said. I love the John Wick movies. And this was just so cool. Um, yeah. Where do we start? Okay, so the comic book is about Ken Reeves. Mm -hmm. And he's this... Um, it's really cool because the character also looks like Ken Reeves. Like, they've drawn him so he resembles Ken Reeves. And I also heard they're making a TV show or a Netflix show about this. I, was, I hope it's someone else than Netflix because the Netflix productions aren't always that good um but yeah so ken reeves is this um half man half horse no um half man half god and he's um he's working for the government i mean in the first issue here it's just pure gore and blood violence uh it's a nice gore fest the whole comic book starts with Kenry's sitting on a bench, and then there are these guys showing up in a car, and they say, like, it's time. And then he's, the next the panel, it's Ken Reeves on a chopper, and just, he's, he's just sitting there, and then his eyes go blue. He becomes uh, Raiden. So he jumps out of this helicopter, and then he's on a mission. And the mission is, um, they're in this, I think it's a Latin American country, and they're extracting this president. So they're using Keanu Reeves to kind of capture the president. And it's so violent. It's so brutal. This is probably the most violent comic book I've read all year. And I read a lot of violent comic books. I like my violence. But this is just next level, man. I mean, I'm just going to describe some of the things you see here. It's very graphic. You have Kenry's punching through a guy's face. And all that's left is the guy's eyes. Like his head just explodes. Let me see if, yeah. I mean, the bottom here, look at that. I mean, when I look, when I look at things like this, it just makes me so happy. Might just be me. And then, like, you also have Ken Reeves punching into this guy's stomach. And then he r rips the guy's ribs out. And he uses that to stab the next guy. How cool is that? And you have something else that is really cool. He's fighting these soldiers. And he rips one guy's arm off. And he beats him to death with his own arm. And I'm not even making this up. When I read this, I was thinking, dude, this comic book was written for me. It's everything I want in a comic book. Yeah. And then he's just like ripping through these soldiers, these tanks, cars, everything. He's just going through all of them just to get to the president. And he's pretty messed up by the end because there, there are explosions and his face and his skin is like torn off and I'm not going to say more about what happens specifically here but after this chapter here when he's killing everything we learn that he's he's immortal and he's um he's in on this government project and they're kind of working on him he suspects that they're cloning him and doing like stuff where he, they're using his genes, but he doesn't care. And he's in on this because he wants to learn how he can die. He wants to be a mortal man. Uh, so he's immortal. And uh, we also learn that he's been around for 80,000 years. There are some funny things here as well. Like he, they give him these pills and... Do they give him a blue or a red pill? They give him a pill half red, half blue. So that's kind of funny. 
and he he's um he has started to remember his past and he says like he can remember when he was born so the next like if you need a story and you're like okay i love the violence cage but what's the story so in the next chapter it kind of slows down and we we get to learn his origin and how everything came to be so it goes back in time, 80,000 years back in time, and he's a part of this tribe. And, you know, so he very quickly becomes, uh, like, he's special and he's different. And whenever you have somebody who's special and different, other people will try to use them to their own agenda. So the leader of the tribe is using Keanu Reeves for his own purposes and for war. And yeah, so we kind of follow him as he's growing up and his tribe and the wars and everything. Yeah, and there's still, you have some other really cool violent stuff going on. But it's not just, I mean, I like the violent stuff, but I would I also enjoy a good story. And you have to have a good story to go with the violence. And I'm very intrigued by this comic book. It had a cool story and all the violence I really wanted for Christmas. So I'm not going to say much more. It's a cool story. Would absolutely recommend you checking this out. Um, and this was a perfect 12th uh, comic book for our advent calendar. Yeah, guys. Um, I mean, not much more to say. I don't like to do too much spoiler heavy stuff. So I would just recommend you checking it out. If you like Ken Reeves, if you like violence, if you like gore, if you like people punching through other people's face, then that comic book is perfect for you. Ah, okay, so just want to say thanks to everyone for tuning in. I really enjoy uh, us spending time together like this and talk about comic books. I really appreciate you guys commenting, liking, and uh, sharing your thoughts on your comic books, your favorite comic books, and what you like. And I hope you had a good time. I wish you a happy new year. Have some fun, and let's hope that uh, year 2022 is a good year. Okay. Yeah, I guess I have to get ready and uh, go and uh, do some stuff. What is this? Oh no! It's back! I don't know what it is. I'm getting this weird sense. Okay, guys, I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. Happy New Year! Baggity baggity, <laughs> chug a pound, a pound. Mmm, cookie. Back a bow likey cookie. Mmm, yum, yum. Mmm, <laughs> mm, chocolate. Mmm, coffee. Coffee, rough, nothing. Mmm, <laughs> Bye-bye.